Hi, I'm Kimberly. My name is Chelsea Moriarty. My name is Portia Sue. My name is Elena Menk. My name is Verna Buk. I'm the Director of Operations here at Hotel Arts Group. And I'm the Chef de Cuisine of Events. Associate Director of Events and Conference Services. I'm the Associate Director of Sales. And I am the Director of Human Resources for Hotel Arts Group. And I commit. And I commit. And I commit. And I commit to breaking the bias. Okay, so I guess just kind of talk about the industry a little bit. Mm -hmm. but, like, Mm -hmm. Like some of the challenges maybe that you've seen in the industry being mm -hmm. a woman in it. And that yeah. Kind of thing. Yeah. The hospitality industry is one where when I started, without dating myself, um, was certainly one where people didn't necessarily always have an education, but sort of fell into it, um, whether it's being a room attendant or a chambermaid back in the day, um, which I did, um, or being a front desk agent or, or a server in an outlet uh, within a hotel. Um, but over the years, I have seen the people that have come through the industry more and more leaning towards um, having an education and really making a career out of this long term. Um, I think that's a really positive change um, because it truly is a career. You need to know a little bit about everything. You need to know human resources. You need to know how to run a business. You need to understand financials and accounting and, and of course, service and, and management. So there's a lot of different facets and, and I believe that we've seen a lot of strong leaders as a result uh, of having had an education in this industry, which typically wasn't one that you necessarily needed one in. Um, students still do come out of school and think that they're going to be a general manager right away, um, and that's not the case, or even a department head, um, but certainly that has changed over the years as well. Um, I've worked in both corporate properties and independent properties. Um, the corporate properties still tend to be a bit more of um, a boys club, if you will, um, but the independent properties, I think, have embraced the change um, much more rapidly, I suppose, um, and given women an opportunity. Hotel Arts Group is a great example of that, not just myself, but we do have a lot of female leaders and department heads and, and people that are really on a fast track to moving up. And, and we've provided those opportunities through, through training and engagement. Um, you know, we tend to involve every level of management and even right down to the hourly level employees, as long as they show an interest. If you show an interest, we will teach you anything. Um, it sometimes backfires. You can spend a long time training people um, and then they end up moving on, but that's okay too because we have given them that base uh, to be able to build their careers and we have a lot of great examples of women that have moved through this property and then moved on to other places, whether it's back to corporate or to other independents or, or even different industries, but really having given them that opportunity to, to excel with this company, um, I think is, is part of our culture for sure. I really like the culture at Hotel Art because I really feel like it's like a big team, like a big family. Um, the reason why I'm saying that is because a lot of time when you work at different companies, when you're in different departments, you don't really see each other or really connect. I feel like working at the hotel, I feel like all the department always become one and then we communicate so well that we work well together. So our leadership team always tries to support you and irrespective of your background, age or gender. Um, and that's what I find really exciting working for Hotel Arts. Again, we have so many wonderful female leaders and it's, it's great to see how different skills come into play when we are all around the table and how our voice is heard. The amount of support and encouragement I've received uh, is huge. So I probably have never worked for the company that's supported women the way we are supported over here. I didn't know where my career was going to go when I first got into human resources. I didn't necessarily have the goal of becoming a director right away. I really wanted to learn everything and in hospitality you're not always specialized in something like other big companies. You know, I get to do all of the aspects of HR here. So I really took my time learning but my director at that time really pushed me to think about getting into leadership um, and so 
that's when I really started to focus on whether or not I could become a director. And I think what inspired me was the other female directors that were on our leadership team at the time. I saw that women could be at the top in our company and had been leading. And I thought that if they could do it, then there would be a place for me. And they, they allowed me onto the group with open arms. And all of the women on the leadership team have been very supportive of me coming on since I started as director. Watching all these women that work within the hotel come up with out-of-the-box ideas that are leaders in driving the business in growing who we are and what our brand is is extremely inspiring and the innovation and culture has just it's something that i can't even begin to explain because it's something you can't feel at any other property so one thing I noticed since being here is the fact that there's a couple like common characteristics between all these women and it's that they are ambitious, they're courageous, they stand up for what they believe in. And I think it's really shown me the fact that, you know, I can do anything so long as I believe in myself and so long as I put the work in and I really just put 110% into everything I do. It's just really inspiring to see this group of women and just how how far they've come in their careers already. So many of them are quite young and have done so much already. So I just know that I'm supported and can do anything I set my mind to.